Hello everyone, Kofter Rafi here. Today we're gonna oh, this light. Today we're gonna do one more test with Tingdiak Mini, but we're gonna use this on Tingdiak application, no Tingdiak Mini application. So I have already uh, uh, uninstalled Tingdiak Mini and I have kicked out C and Launch file. Then I have installed Tingdiak Plus application on my Android phone. And we're gonna check what difference is on this application, what we can to do, and eventually problems, if there is some problems. So, uh, maybe firstly we're gonna connect Tingdiak, this main Tingdiak, check what we can to do with Tingdiak, uh, what we have with Tingdiak, and then we change for Tingdiak Mini, and then we can see differences. So we start the application, like you see, there is Tingdiak application. We check device. We change for Tingdiak. We have connected to the car Tingdiak VCI. Then we press here. Like you see, I have all the sensors for those car makes. There is some difference, like you see, Citroen 2023, but Suzuki I have 2022. So those will have almost one year more. That was those softwares I have purchased uh, before. That was this uh, promotion for uh, all softwares, you know. Like you see, GM Brazil, GM Brasilia, so on, so on. When I have done Polish version, I have problem to connect. There was this D license problem, but I'm gonna show you now. See, that was those. Yeah, and then we have maintenance function, like you see. I have all of maintenance function I can use. Then we have OBD, next thing easy, TPMS, and HML, that's for trucks. So we're gonna, okay, we're gonna check that. If there is the same problem like was before. And we firstly choose Jeep. Then we're gonna see. Like you see, the license fail. Okay, we press OK. We try again. Now it press Chrysler.jeep. We are sitting now on 2005 Jeep Grand Cherokee. And you see, it's connected. So we can do health report. Okay. And it's working. So I will wait a little bit. I supposed to show you Ting Diak Mini how it's work on that one, but okay, we wait, it's a couple seconds also.
like you see that was those and when we press here PCM and then you have special function system test OBD2 monitors restream actuation test read configuration read and clear file codes model information that was that we go out yes then we take out our OBD Ting Jack and now we put Ting Jack Mini okay Ting Jack Mini sitting in so we're gonna change to Ting Jack Mini like you see we have changed it for Ting Jack Mini VCI then you have the same still the same there's Ting Jack application so it's still the same now we're going to um, first you maybe OBD functions so and it's connected it's matched okay so like you see it's everything like on previous application thing the mini application everything the same so we go out from here that works uh, out maintenance function and like you see i have changed it to think jack mini so now i must pay for every maintenance function but i do not do that now I have already paid uh, last time for Chrysler software for this uh, review purposes and like you see on Tingdiac application you have some extra car makes <laughs> Alto Chinese car makes you know you see Jeep Dodge and Chrysler that was what we do, have done last time so we're gonna try again with that one wind decoding so now we're using Tingdiac Mini and we're gonna do the same test like on Tingdiac so there is some little glitch you know I think so in the software so. and we press again Jeep we're sitting 2005 Jeep and I think so there's gonna be the same problem or no this time has communicate so i think it's some glitch you know software glitch i think so or maybe i have pressed chrysler maybe i have pressed chrysler okay when then we do health report So like you see everything works. yeah and we press again pcm so you can see differences between thing like you see this read file code clean falcon and read data stream that is thing mini so you don't have this extra functions actuation test so on so on yeah so you have only this what you can make read clear falcons and read data stream that's it that's what you can do with Tingdiac Mini we go out and we're gonna double check when we if we have pressed 
we go through the jeep manually we're gonna check if there is connection now it's communicated 16 pin jeep 2005 Grand Cherokee and health report also okay that works so the same we're gonna check so that was some software glitch I think so maybe some little bit problem so we go out again from Ting Jack Mini and we put again Ting Jack Okay, and we check Ting Jack. Okay, we must uh, go out. Just Ting Jack, and we're gonna check again. Go manually to the Jeep. There's a lot of more cars, so we must go down. Yeah, it's beeping, start to connect. And like you see, now it's worked, so maybe application start recognize that's Jeep, it's Chrysler. <laughs> Let me press Jeep, again 2005. We run and we go to health report. Yeah, end session. End session. I don't know. Yes, I will exit. So, like you see, that was that's it for today. Yeah. So, like you have seen it. Tingdiak Mini works on Tingdiak application, Tingdiak Plus application, Android device. No problem, that was before, little bit problem with the license, you know, when I have pressed Jeep, you can see this on uh, my Polish version. But after a couple connections, it seems to stabilize. Now it's all uh, more stable, so maybe the software has recognized, oh, a Jeep is from Chrysler, and this Jeep is Jeep. <laughs> yes, you know, that is some glitches, and you have, you, if you have this problem, try to film a wire fix, if it doesn't work, uh, try to, you know, restart your mobile phone, and try again, if you have, uh, example, like me, Jeep, this is uh, Chrysler, you know. So try through Chrysler and then next time try to, to uh, do it by Jeep. So maybe it's going to stabilize like uh, on my situation. Now. So I think so. That's it for today. <coughs> Sorry. And if you like it, like it. If you like, subscribe, share. And if you want to support me, my channel. There, there gonna be a Patreon link to that. I hope so you like like this. So now you see differences between also Tingdiak and Tingdiak Mini. What you have extra with Tingdiak, and I think so Tingdiak it's better choice. Uh, Tingdiak Mini I think so it's cost uh, fifty bucks, and you must purchase every software separately. You know every reset every. It's almost 20 bucks for every software, every card makes. So, Ting Jack is a better solution. You and you can, you have a little bit more to do with that one also. You can do a little bit more. If you want only for one card and only read and clear file codes, eventually uh, check some. Uh, 
data stream Tindiak also is better and this uh, normal version Tindiak cost maybe 80 bucks you can get for 80 bucks and you have I think so for two years two car makes for this price or even one car make so it's gonna be the same price I think so that is only my suggestion if you want ev every car makes so Tindiak gonna cost you 300 bucks and you have every car makes so if you count this Tindiak mini 50 bucks maybe plus uh, uh, all software what you're gonna need 200 bucks maybe 300 bucks or more so my suggestion by Tindiak that's it for today stay tuned so next video gonna be I think so gonna be up car Diak FCA how to program key on the Jeep I have got a question about that one and uh, how to update um, uh, X tool mini OBD uh, X horse sorry X horse mini OBD through the PC this video coming soon also so I must download everything you know and do ready for film stay tuned until next time